Getting started with Virtual Studio is easy. In the initial view, we can see the main desk which has the console, devices, and patch bay. Hold the right mouse button and drag to look around the room. To navigate the environment, click on a desired hardware unit. Use the scroll wheel or two finger scroll to zoom in and out of the console. Click and drag on the labels to pan side to side. Interact with parameters the way you instinctively would. They can be tweaked up close or when zoomed out. Engage with the external devices the same way. The camera shortcuts allow us to quickly navigate the environment. The routing matrix of our session is the patch bay. The classic tape machine serves a deep purpose in Virtual Studio and will be described in a later video. The remaining toolbar functions are for playback, sources, guide, and settings. We'll use the steps in the basic tutorial to demonstrate audio playback and output. Signal enters the channel strip at the input section. Raise the gain knob, notice the meter activity above. Signal then flows down the channel strip where it hits the channel fader. Raise the channel fader and notice the meter activity in the master section. To hear the output of the console, we raise the monitor volume. Outside the basic tutorial, users will have to set up their own bus assignments to feed the output of the console.